So you guys have really liked my no license wholesale vendor video. So here's another no license wholesale vendor list. And I got some good ones for you guys. She's an icon, she's a legend, and she is the moment. Now come on now. What's up icons? It's the iconic fashion figure. And this video is for you guys that are looking for no license wholesale vendors. But there's more. So not only is this just no license wholesale vendors, I'm giving you guys a designer no license wholesale vendor where you can get this Gucci bag at wholesale price with no license. I tested out the website myself, it's legit. Or how about you guys have been asking where places like Misguided and Pretty Little Thing gets their clothing from? Well, I have some of their vendors for you guys as well. So let's get into this no license wholesale vendor list with 12 new vendors for you guys. Oh and men's, I didn't forget about you guys either. There's a few of these that sell men's as well. So let's go with number one. Number one is an LA based wholesale vendor and the name of it is called LA Apparel. Now for those of you that keep asking for drop ship vendors, this would be a good one for drop shipping as well because they have some of their items that are in open packs meaning you can just buy one two pieces and then there's also pre-packs too so if you want to buy like a pack of six you can do that as well so this will be perfect for those of you that are looking for a drop ship vendor since there are open packs and you can buy one of a style or two of a style if you need to and to take it a step even further they also offer private labeling so those of you that want to private label your garments they offer that as well so I wanted to start this video off strong with LA apparel because that would be a good one for you guys you don't need a license you can do drop shipping you can private label if you want and it's based in the US and not just based in the US but it's made in the US it's made right in downtown LA so for those of you pretty much that vendor seems like it checks off all boxes except for men's and kids but that's the first vendor of this video next we're going into number two with catwalk wholesale I feel like a couple of these I may have done in the first video so I apologize if that's already in there but I just wanted to do it just in case because I didn't have time to go check but catwalk wholesale is number two they are a UK based wholesale vendor but they do have express delivery to the US. They also offer private labeling so for those of you that are interested in private labeling that is one for you to go to as well. Now they do have an MOQ so their minimum order amount is a hundred pounds which is about 134 US dollars but catwalk wholesale number two. Now I'm going into number three and number three is good stuff apparel which is also based in LA so this is another another LA wholesale vendor. Now the catch with Good Stuff Apparel, they sell overstock and like leftovers from different vendors that are based in LA. So some of these styles you may have seen at other vendors and they're reselling it to you guys. But the pricing is not too much of a difference from what you would get from the actual vendor. You might even get it cheaper because they're buying the overstock and the leftovers and they're buying in huge quantities so that way they get the pricing super low. They're buying the stuff what's called off price. So they're basically getting all this product dirt cheap to help those vendors clear out their inventory to make way for new inventory and then good stuff apparel sells it to you you don't need a license to buy from them you can buy what it is that you need from them and the pricing is still at wholesale cost so it's not like you're paying some super high pricing because they had to buy it from the vendor no they actually probably paid a lot less to the vendor so good stuff apparel number three now going into number four is influence wholesale this is another UK based wholesale vendor but this one's a good one. So this wholesale vendor sells to big brands that you guys are most likely familiar with like ASOS and Misguided. So for those of you that have been asking where does Misguided get their clothing from, check out Influence Wholesale. That's one of their wholesale vendors and they offer men's clothing as well. And now I'm going into number five. So number five is our designer wholesale vendor that you can buy from without a license and I actually created an account on this website to check it out for myself because I didn't believe it and I didn't want to give that information to you guys and then it ends up being junk so I did have to check this one out for myself but let me give you the name first because I'm sitting here rambling and didn't even tell you the name so number five is Brands Gateway now they sell a bunch of different designer brands like Gucci, Versace, Balenciaga like there's a long list of different designers they have listed now when you go on there you may see all the designers 
designers listed. Not all of them actually have product on there. I think it's on like a first come first serve type of basis. If they have an item, they list it for that brand, but you have to be one of the first to get it. Cause like the Gucci bag that I looked at on there, I think there was only like five pieces available. So you have to get on it right away. But they are offering the pricing at wholesale pricing. It was almost like half of what you would pay as the retail price. So I went searching on there, just kind of browsing to see if it was legitimate. And that's when I came across this Gucci bag that I was looking at. It's a legitimate style. The MSRP that they have listed on there is accurate. If you look up this bag, you can see other websites like Farfetch, for example, selling it at that retail price, but you're paying almost half at the wholesale rate. So it is legitimate. There are different designer products in there. Now, the one thing that I didn't check is if the items are authentic. I didn't actually buy anything on here because I noticed a lot of the styles look like they may be older styles too, but keep checking this website. Often you're more than likely going to find some decent products on there and it's all designer products. You don't need a license for this website. It's free to join. Now I will say the products, they're all coming from different places. Like a few of the products I looked at, some were coming from Germany. There was one, I think coming from, I don't even remember where that item was coming from, but then the one that I'm just showing you guys right now, that one was coming from New Jersey. So there are some items in the US. There are some that are overseas. Brands Gateway does offer drop shipping. So I know that's usually like my number one question once I post a vendor list is do these vendors offer drop shipping? So yes, Brands Gateway does offer drop shipping. So for those of you that would like to be able to drop ship designer items, they do have a drop ship program. And it's the program where you can add their items to your website. And when your customer places an order on your website, then you can order it from Brands Gateway and they ship it directly to your customer. And here they're telling you, you can earn up to 250% margin per order, which is a really good margin. You're making really good money here, especially on an order you don't even have to touch the item. All you're doing is listing products onto your website, which they even make that easier for you. But the catch here is that you have to pay for their program. They do have a monthly fee or you can pay it quarterly or annually and it saves you money. But those packages are a bit of a pretty penny. But I'm gonna explain to you why it makes sense to still do it if you're looking to do drop shipping because it is worth it when you first see the numbers, which I'm about to show you right now. It can be like sticker shock, but it's actually worth it. So for the drop shipping packages, here's the monthly, quarterly, annually. So as you can see, if you were to pay this by month, so you go month to month, it's $324 a month. And it seems like a lot, but it's really not that bad. Now, if you go quarterly, you obviously pay a little less per month. It's $217 per month, but they will bill you quarterly. So you would pay $649 every three months. And then you have annual. So once a year, you would pay that $1864, which would be broken down to $156 per month, which $156 per month is definitely good, definitely much better than $324, but you would have to be able to pay the $1864 up front. So if you have that $1864 to invest up front, it's definitely worth it. Because for example, that Gucci bag that I showed you, you would be paying just about this much just for that one item. Now you can take that and buy one item, but then you only have one item to list and you have to wait for that to sell. And then once you make the money off of that, you pretty much doubled your money. Now you can go buy two more of them and sell it or two other items and sell them. But it would be a slow process where you're listing one item and then maybe two the next time and then you're just building up your inventory. Whereas you can take that 1864 and instead of just buying one item, you can list all the products that are on their website and then sell those to your customers as, as they pay you. And then once you make that first sale, let's say you sell that Gucci bag for that $2,500, you've already made your money back for the annual subscription anyway. So one sell covers your annual subscription and any money from there is just money in your pocket and you're only buying them as you sell them. So as long as you can just make that one sell of $1,800 or more, your annual fee is covered anyway. So it's definitely worth it. It just depends on how you look at it and if you have the money to invest right away. But the reason I said before it, they make it easy on you to list the items is they have an automated integration with Shopify and WooCommerce. So if you have your store on one of these platforms, it's easy to list the items because they already have it integrated. So here it just goes through some of the information on it, some of the features. Um, they tell you all the benefits. I'll let you guys check out the website for yourself.
itself here it shows you like the profits you can make off of these items some of them have higher profit margins but just depends on what you are selling but i'll let you guys check this out i just wanted to show you that they do offer drop shipping so you can start drop shipping authentic designer items but let's go into number six number six is babes london which is going to be located in london this is a wholesale vendor that sells in packs of three to twelve pieces so you can get some packs that only have three pieces but it can go up to 12 pieces so you'll want to pay attention to the styles that you are interested in to see how many pieces you're actually buying but they don't have an moq you just have to buy in the pre-packs vendor number seven for this video is stylewise direct this is another you UK based wholesale vendor that offers different women's clothing. So they have categories like tops, bottoms, dresses, active wear, and new styles are being added every single day. They don't have an MOQ and they do ship to several different countries. Now are you guys ready for the wholesale vendor that ships to Pretty Little Thing? So I know a lot of you are always asking where does Pretty Little Thing get their clothing from? This is one of Pretty Little Thing's wholesale vendors. They also sell to Boohoo and Misguided and that is Mia Fashions. They are located in the UK so this is a UK wholesale vendor but you guys asked and I delivered. This is Pretty Little Things vendor. That's one of them. Doesn't mean all their clothing comes from here. So they do offer a bunch of different women's categories like dresses, tops, bottoms. They have swimwear as well and then they also have like loungewear and nightwear. And then I have a couple more UK wholesale vendors before we get back into the US vendors. So number nine is Loud Wholesale, another UK based vendor, and they offer both clothing and accessories for women. And then number 10, we have Whispering Smith. This is another wholesale vendor that also sells to ASOS. They do have men's available as well for those of you that are looking for men's clothing. So now let's get back into the US. Here's another US wholesale vendor that you do not need a license for, and that is Superline. Superline Wholesale. They are based in Atlanta for those of you that are on the east coast Atlanta area this is a wholesale vendor for you guys for anyone pretty much they do offer men's and women's now this is a no license wholesale vendor their website makes it very clear they sell to everyone but of course if you want to avoid taxes you'll want to send in your documents so that way you don't have to pay taxes on your purchases and then they also do offer printing and embroidery as well because they do sell a lot of blank items and then the last vendor for this video vendor number 12 12 is Got Apparel. This is another vendor that sells blank items. So I'm talking about like hoodies, t-shirts, sweatpants, shorts, that type of stuff that you can add different graphics and logos to. They are US based, but they have different warehouses in different areas. So I noticed Atlanta listed on there. California was listed on there. I forget the other city I saw on there. So there's a few different places of where your product will be shipped from, but it is US based. And then they do offer screen printing and embroidery as as well so that is 12 no license wholesale vendors for you guys you have in there where pretty little thing is getting their clothing from as well as asos boohoo misguided and then you also have designer clothing in there there's women's and there's men's as well thank you for watching